CIET NCERT presents Audiobook of Mathematics for Class 7 Chapter 3 Data Handling Page 62 3.5.1 Range The difference between the highest and the lowest observation gives us an idea of the spread of the observations. This can be found by subtracting the lowest observation from the highest observation. We call the result the range of the observation. Look at the following example. Example 3. The ages in years of 10 teachers of a school are 32, 41, 28, 54, 35, 26, 23, 33, 38, 40. 1. What is the age of the oldest teacher and that of the youngest teacher? 2. What is the range of the ages of the teachers? 3. What is the mean age of these teachers? Solution 1. Arranging the ages in ascending order, we get 23, 26, 28, 32, 33, 35, 38, 40, 41, 54. We find that the age of the oldest teacher is 54 years and the age of the youngest teacher is 23 years. 2. Range of the ages of the teachers is equal to 54 minus 23 years, which is equal to 31 years. 3. Mean age of the teachers is equal to 23 plus 26 plus 28 plus 32 plus 33 plus 35 plus 38 plus 40 plus 41 plus 54 divided by 10 years which is equal to 350 divided by 10 years, which is equal to 35 years. Exercise 3.1 1. Find the range of heights of any 10 students of your class. 2. Organize the following marks in a class assessment in a tabular form. 4, 6, 7, 5, 3, 5, 4, 5, 2, 6, 2, 5, 1, 9, 6, 5, 8, 4, 6, 7. 1. Which number is the highest? 2. Which number is the lowest? 3. What is the range of the data? 4. Find the arithmetic mean. 3. Find the mean of the first five whole numbers. 4. A cricketer scores the following runs in eight innings. 58, 76, 40, 35, 46, 45, 0, 100. Find the mean score. Page 63. 5. Following table shows the points of each player scored in four games. The columns are Player, Game 1, Game 2, Game 3, Game 4 A. 14, 16, 10, 10 B. 
zero eight six four C eight eleven did not play thirteen. Now answer the following questions. One find the mean to determine Hayes average number of points scored per game. 2. To find the mean number of points per game for C, would you divide the total points by 3 or by 4? Why? 3. B played in all the four games. How would you find the mean? 4. Who is the best performer? 6. The marks out of 100 obtained by a group of students in a science test are 85, 76, 90, 85, 39, 48, 56, 95, 81 and 75. Find the 1. Highest and the lowest marks obtained by the students. 2. Range of the marks obtained. 3. Mean marks obtained by the group. 7. The enrollment in a school during six consecutive years was as follows. 1,555 1,670 1,750, 2,013, 2,540, 2,820. Find the mean enrollment of the school for this period. 8. The rainfall in millimetres in a city on seven days of a certain week was recorded as follows day rainfall in millimeters monday 0, 0.0 tuesday 12.2 wednesday 2.1 thursday 0, 0.0 friday 20.5 saturday 5.5 Sunday 1.01. 1. Find the range of the rainfall in the above data. 2. Find the mean rainfall for the week. 3. On how many days was the rainfall less than the mean rainfall? 9. The heights of 10 girls were measured in centimeter and the results are as follows. 135, 150, 139, 128, 151, 132, 146, 149, 143, 141. 1. What is the height of the tallest girl? 2. What is the height of the shortest girl? 3. What is the range of the data? 4. What is the mean height of the girls? 5. How many girls have heights more than the mean height? Page 64 3.6 Mode as we have said, mean is not the only measure of central tendency or the only form of representative value. For different requirements from a data, other measures of central tendencies are used. Look at the following example. To find out the weekly demand for different sizes of shirt, a shopkeeper kept records of sales of sizes 90 cm, 95 cm, 
100 centimeter, 105 centimeter, 110 centimeter. Following is the record for a week. Size in inches. Number of shirts sold. 90 centimeter, 8. 95 centimeter, 22. 100 centimeter, 32. 105 centimeter, 37. 110 centimeter, 6. Total, 105. If he found the mean number of shirts sold, do you think that he would be able to decide which shirt sizes to keep in stock? Mean of total shirts sold is equal to total number of shirts sold divided by number of different sizes of shirts, which is equal to 105 upon 5, which is equal to 21. Should he obtain 21 shirts of each size? If he does so, will he be able to cater to the needs of the customers? The shopkeeper, on looking at the record, decides to procure shirts of sizes 95 centimeters, 100 centimeters, 105 centimeters. He decided to postpone the procurement of the shirts of other sizes because of their small number of buyers. Look at another example. The owner of a ready-made dress shop says, the most popular size of dress I sell is the size 90 cm. Observe that here also, the owner is concerned about the number of shirts of different sizes sold. She is, however, looking at the shirt size that is sold the most. This is another representative value for the data. The highest occurring event is the sale of size 90 centimeters. This representative value is called the mode of the data. The mode of a set of observations is the observation that occurs most often. Example 4 Find the mode of the given set of numbers 1, 1, 2, 4, 3, 2, 1, 2, 2, 4 Solution Arranging the numbers with same values together we get 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 2, 2, 3, 4, 4. Mode of this data is 2 because it occurs more frequently than other observations. 3.6.1 Mode of large data. Putting the same observations together and counting them is not easy if the number of observations is large. In such cases, we tabulate the data. Tabulation can begin by putting tally marks and finding the frequency, as you did in your previous class. Page 65 Look at the following example. Example 5 Following are the margins of victory in the football matches of a league. 1, 3, 2, 5, 1, 4, 6, 2, 5, 2, 2, 2, 4, 1, 2, 3, 1, 1, 2, 3, 2, 6, 4, 3, 2, 1, 1, 4, 2, 1, 5, 3, 3, 2, 3, 2, 4, 
two, one, two. Find the mode of this data. Solution. Let us put the data in a tabular form. Margins of victory, tally bars, number of matches. One, five, four, nine. Two, five, five, four. Fourteen, three, five, two, seven. Four, five, five, five. Three, three, six, two, two. Total, forty. Looking at the table, we can quickly say that two is the mode, since two has occurred the highest number of times. Thus, most of the matches have been won with a victory margin of two goals. Try these. Find the mode of one, two, six, five, three, zero, three, four, three, two, four, five, two, four, two, two, fourteen, sixteen, twelve, fourteen, fourteen, sixteen, fourteen. 10, 14, 18, 14. Think, discuss and write. Can a set of numbers have more than one mode? Example 6. Find the mode of the numbers. 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, 5, 5, 5, Six, six, eight. Solution. Here, two and five both occur three times. Therefore, they both are modes of the data. Do this. One. Record the age in years of all your classmates. Tabulate the data and find the mode. 2. Record the heights in centimeters of your classmates and find the mode. Try these. 1. Find the mode of the following data. 12, 14, 12, 16, 15, 13, 14, 18, 19, 12, 14, 15, 16, 15, 16, 16, 15, 17, 13, 16, 16, 15, 15, 13, 15, 17, 15, 14, 15, 13, 15, 14. Page 66. 2. Heights in centimeter of 25 children are given below. 168, 165, 163, 160, 163, 161, 162, 164, 163, 162, 164, 163, 160, 163, 160, 165, 163, 162, 163, 164, 163, 160, 165, 163, 162. What is 
the mode of their heights. What do we understand by mode here? Whereas mean gives us the average of all observations of the data, the mode gives that observation which occurs most frequently in the data. Let us consider the following examples. A. You have to decide upon the number of chapatis needed for 25 people called for a feast. B. A shopkeeper selling shirts has decided to replenish her stock. C. We need to find the height of the door needed in our house. D. When going on a picnic, if only one fruit can be bought for every one, which is the fruit that we would get? In which of these situations can we use the mode as a good estimate? Consider the first statement. Suppose the number of chapatis needed by each person is 2, 3, 2, 3, 2, 1, 2, 3, 2, 2, 4, 2, 2, 3, 2, 4, 4, 2, 3, 2, 4, 2, 4, 3, 5. The mode of the data is 2 chapatis. If we use mode as the representative value for this data, then we need 50 chapatis only, 2 for each of the 25 persons. However, the total number would clearly be inadequate. Would mean be an appropriate representative value? For the third statement, the height of the door is related to the height of the persons using that door. Suppose there are five children and four adults using the door and the height of each of five children is around 135 centimeters. The mode for the heights is 135 centimeters. Should we get a door that is 144 centimeters high? Would all the adults be able to go through that door? It is clear that mode is not the appropriate representative value for this data. Would mean be an appropriate representative value here? Why not? Which representative value of height should be used to decide the door height? Similarly, analyze the rest of the statements and find the representative value useful for that issue. Try these. Discuss with your friends and give a. Two situations where mean would be an appropriate representative value to use and b. Two situations where mode would be an appropriate representative value to use. You were just listening to the audiobook Mathematics for Class 7. Narrator, Gaurav Marva. Assistance in Production, Samya Malik. Producer, Vimlesh Chaudhary. Presented by CIET, NCERT, New Delhi, India.